Hi everybody. Um, I just had hip replacement surgery on my left hip six days ago and uh, I'm making a video log of how I do things around the house and to save a little money I decided not to buy a $2,000 chair and to stack some cushions. This is where we typically sit. It's an older couch but we like it um, but it's too low for me. Um, with hip surgery, you're not supposed to bring your knee up past 90 degrees or bend over so your hip rotates 90 degrees. So the idea is to stay far away from that. It's uncomfortable and it's not safe. Your hip may pop out if that happens and nobody wants this surgery twice. Um, so I stole a cushion from the other side of the couch and I just stacked it on here. I have a big cushion here and I may use that red cushion as well. The proper way of doing this is to always stick this, uh, the affected leg straight so that you're not bending it. Um, not that you can't bend your knee, but we just don't want that to raise up too much. So you would place this foot out a little bit, scoot a little close to the couch, push these cushions down, use your right arm to brace, and lower yourself with all the weight of your body on your other leg, on your right leg in this case. And then you can adjust yourself, sit back, and relax. And it's happening pretty easy for me now because I've been doing it for six days or five days because um, I spent the night in the hospital. But um, the main issue is you don't want your foot or your leg to rotate in. You don't want to cross your legs. You definitely don't want this foot to rotate in at all uh, because your hip might pop out. And the way you stand up is just the opposite. You want to lean forward, get your elbow of your uh, right, the opposite side of the leg that was affected to use yourself to brace, push down, make sure this knee doesn't rotate in or your toes don't rotate in. You may have to hold that out. Put all your weight on your good leg and stand up straight. That's a really safe way of doing it. You should not get in a hurry doing any movements with this hip. If you're worried about it, just go very, very slow and you'll be safe. Um, that's it for now. Thanks.